Hey, welcome guys. Welcome to this series where we are explaining you the code for the program that you requested us. Uh, now, uh, today's program is fairly simple. Uh, what we are going to do is just swap two numbers uh, with the help of temporary. Uh, now, there are two programs that we will be doing. Uh, one is with temporary variable and other is without the temporary variable. This one is the one with the temporary variable. Now, let's look. Now, for those people who don't know what is swapping, suppose we have a variable 1 which has uh, 125 stored in it and we have a variable 2 which has 25 stored in it. Now, what we want to do is just to swap the contents. That is interchange the content of uh, each variable now this is swapping now uh, how do we do this in code now let's look at the algorithm that we need uh, that we'll be using to um, swap the uh, numbers now suppose we have a uh, variable 1 and variable 2 in variable 1 we have 125 stored and variable 2 we have 25 stored now what we want to do is that we'll shift the variable 2 into a temporary variable for temporary storage and then what we'll do is we'll shift 125 into the variable 2 so now variable 2 has 125 and the next step that we will do is that we'll shift the temporary variable into variable 1 now if you see variable 1 and variable 2 now the out uh, the values have been swapped now this is the algorithm that we will be using uh, uh, to swap the numbers now if you have any doubt you can comment in the description uh, uh, sorry uh, in the uh, comment section uh, we'll try to solve your doubt as soon as possible now let's jump into the code now what I just did is I just created uh, a new uh, program uh, file uh, named it as uh, swap temp dot c and now I'll just begin writing the code first we'll just include the stdio for input output now let's write down main now what we want to do is we will have two variables right no, actually, actually we need three variables two to store the uh, variable one and variable two and the third will be temporary so we'll just declare the variables now that we have declared the variable, we'll ask the input from the user. Now we'll just scan the uh, input from the user. Now that we have our input, we'll uh, we'll just actually print the variable uh, the variables uh, so the before swapping them so that uh, we can see the output properly. Now we'll just apply the logic uh, that we discussed. First, what we'll do we'll just put uh, we'll just assign the temporary as variable the value from the variable 2 now we'll shift the value of variable 1 into variable 2 And now we'll shift the temporary into variable 1. Now our swapping logic is completed. Now we'll just print them uh, after swapping. Now let's see if uh, we get the proper output that we were expecting. Just compile it. Okay, so no errors. Now we'll just run it. So it's asking for a first value and the second value. So we'll input say 120, 125 and 25 that we had just seen. Now let's see. Now before swapping, the values were 125 and 25. Now after swapping, uh, 25 it changed from 25 to 125. So we have successfully completed this program. Uh, now thank you for watching this. Uh, please uh, like the video and subscribe for many. I will be posting a lot of videos. Now if you want any program to be done by us, now you can put it in the comment section. Uh, we'll try to post the video as soon as possible. Thank you.